up uh, in that field at the moment. <laughs> Zendro Nanini, whom a lot of people, John, are, and boy, Bobby's getting close, isn't he? A lot of people say that Nanini is a good racer and that this car and the setting that he's had this year has not really given him an opportunity to show his true potential. So perhaps somebody to keep your eyes on for the future. Well, of course, he did very well in Formula 3. He's a young driver with all the heart of the greatest lions out there. As we see a picture of Gerhard Berger, the Austrian. But uh, Nanini has not really had a facility this year to match his talents, and we look for great things for him in the future. But look at Bobby. Look at Bobby. He's just setting his teammate up. He's right up his exhaust. He's going around the outside, having a good look on the brakes. Oh, he's through. Bobby, the Italian, coming through his teammate somewhat easily, I would say. I don't, th into the Bosch turn, I don't think Gerhardt, certainly let him by. Gerhardt's coming by now. Tail Bobby, is slowing. He slowing is definitely again. slowing. Here, right after taking the lead, what a misfortune! I mean, it's tough enough to drop out of a race, but when it happens just after you finally take the lead, what could cause something like that to happen? Well, you know, he dropped back once before in somewhat the same situation. Now oh. he's back up to speed. It could be a gear selection problem, or possibly a fuel pickup that Bosch turned. As I see, he has his hand up. 